Turner, not surprisingly, painted one of the earliest pictures of London's fog in the 1835 painting The Thames Above Waterloo Bridge. Turner, as a true born Londoner, is advertising his familiarity with London's air problem by putting smoke and atmospheric pollution at its centre. And as you can see in here, the bridge is the central element, um, which is a theme that's later taken up by Monet. And it's, um, it's partly obscured by um, uh, the steam and smoke which rises from both sides of the river. Um, here we see a shot tower, I think you can just about see it, um, which was constructed in 1826. Um, do you know what shot towers are? They produce shot for um, uh, guns, ammunition. And they were very smoky, one of the more smoky in industries. Um, but it's barely visible, as you can see, um, um, as are the various industries on the Lambeth side of the river. Um, there's On this side, there's a, a steamship um, about to dock or preparing to leave. It's black smoke thrusting up to join the kind of swirling arc of smoke there. Um, William Rodner sees this painting as a potent essay on the energy and complexity of modern polluted urbanism. Smoke, I think, here represents a flourishing economy which brings employment and food on tables, but also the dirt and pollution associated with its fumes. All seems to be tainted by a sulphurous yellow